Robbie, especially you've um, extended your stay at Bolton Wanderers for another year. How's that feel? Yeah, fantastic. Um, it's the only place I wanted to be, to be honest. It's uh, it's good for my family and I've, I've enjoyed every moment since I've come through the door. The last two years have been great. Both completely different scenarios in terms of getting promoted the first season and uh, uh, the second season stopping up in uh, a dramatic final day, which was which was really good, an emotional day um, for everybody, but you know a great day. Um, <coughs> so it's uh, it's fair to say, on the first two years at Bolton Wonders, they've been um, dramatic, but uh, good dramatic. Um, and like I say, it's the only place I wanted to be. I enjoy playing here, and um, the fans have been great with me, and uh, and the staff have been fantastic as well with me. So it's um, it's good to extend my stay for another year. I know, summer's gone, blink of an eye, back to pre-season. It has, yeah, <laughs> but they always seem to go quick the holidays, but um, you know, the, the lads have been itching to get back in and then uh, we've got back in and we've shown that you know the lads have kept ticking over over the summer, because um, everyone that comes back in, come, has come back in um, is, is really fit and um, what, whatever we've been asked to do, <coughs> the lads have passed with flying colours so far and that will stand us in good stead um, for a good start this season, which we know. Uh, we didn't get off to a good start last year, and um, that's the the platform platform you need to work from is your fitness. And uh, once um, once we've got these hard running sessions out of the way, which no one enjoys, then uh, we can start enjoying this football, um, get the balls out more, and uh, and and look towards that first game of the season. Have you found it this week being up in Scotland? Obviously, the weather will take its toll, but should you rather be in in this kind of weather rather than rain? I wouldn't actually. I'd uh, tend to disagree with that. <laughs> I like a bit of drizzle, uh, being a defender. But um, yeah, it's it's summer. Obviously, it's, we're we're going through a hot hot period at the minute. But we can't control that. Uh, whatever we're asked to do, we're going to do it. Um, whatever the weather. And um, but it's it's a little bit cooler up here, to be honest. So it's actually a lot better to train up here. A few degrees cooler. So, but yeah, um, the weather's obviously taking its toll a little bit. Um, but the lads have had to push through, and like I said earlier, that um, everyone's pacifying close so far. Um, touch wood, injury free as well for most of the boys, and uh, and hopefully by the end of the pre-season we'll have a good one under our belts. Get the games going, get the lads back used to what they were doing last year, positional play, and uh, whatever they need to do. And um, like I say, we'll be looking forward to that first game of the season away at West Brom. Nick Allen B is certainly not going to hold any punches in regards to what you guys are going to be doing this week, is he? He doesn't hold back, Nick. Uh, he's, um, he keeps his cards close to his chest as well. He doesn't tell any of the boys um, what, what we're going to be doing. They're, they're eager to know, but he, uh, he leaves it till the final minute to let us know right until we're on them, uh, right, right until we're on the grass. Um, but it, um, it's his techniques, and you know we will we'll do with what we're asked to do, and we have done so far, and we'll continue to do that um, because fitness is a massive thing. It, um, you know the, the last few minutes of each game, um, there can be the difference uh, in a lot of the games you're playing throughout the season, and um, fitness is a big, big factor in that. So um, if we can get ourselves fit, then the football should take care of itself. You've got a couple of new faces as well added to the squad. How are they settling? Yeah, they've gelled in fantastic. Um, but I've said this since I've been here. I've, I've always. Always said there's uh, been a good group of lads and they still ha still are at the minute. Um, albeit there's not as many at the minute. Um, but since I've been here, there's been a great set of lads. Everyone that's came in has, has found themselves reasonably comfortable straight away, and um, that's exactly how I felt. And the boys that are coming this summer, and they've come in this summer already. Um, have, uh, I'm sure they'll say the exact same thing. Look forward to getting back out onto the actual football pitch on Saturday against Yeah, I think any player will say that. Um, they'd much rather go out and play on a football fit pitch rather than around the run a running track. Uh, so, but we know what we need to do. They're the, they're the hard parts in pre-season we need to get through. Um, and then when we get onto the football pitch, we can you know get back used to what we're doing, um, positional play and, and, whatever, and whatever you need to be doing. So, yeah, um, I'm looking forward to Saturday getting. Um, However minutes we're going to be playing, um, we'll get out there, work as hard as we can because it's a fitness program. We're still in pre-season, um, but at the same time, it's uh, it's football and it's what we enjoy doing.